Yeah. 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 You can uh, tell us when to come, when to come on so that we don't miss. Eh? Yeah. Now, Bona is VT. When he was been missing. Yeah, but who had been using this seat before the camera? It's a, it's a oh. <laughs> I didn't know. But I'm here to smile, kid. Don't go I thank you, members of the press. My name is. Um, Benjamin Jomo Ashiari. I am the MP for Mumias East. I represent the people of Mumias East in the National Assembly. And um, at the same time, I am the chief whip, a majority party in the National Assembly. And uh, I'm here with my colleagues from uh, Western Region to comment on what has been consistently been coming out in uh, our media. It is not usual that uh, as a leader of uh, uh, parliament, we will uh, comment on what our colleagues are uh, talking. But uh, this became apparent because my counterpart, who is a leader of minority, chief whip minority, our brother, Jonette, has consistently been commenting on a party that he doesn't belong. Yesterday, just yesterday, he was talking of how the deputy president needs to resign, how Jubilee needs to conduct his business, how the government needs to conduct its business, I want to say it here, that we are the people who made Jubilee and the government what it is today. And that we are still available for any comment that will better or correct or improve our party. For our brother Junet, who is my counterpart, in the face of the handshake and now the ongoing BBI, I don't think we will continually allow him to make the comments that he's making because these comments, some, it is affecting us because we know when we went to the elections of 2017, we had the president and the deputy president and uh, we voted for them, we voted for them as presidency together. Therefore, you cannot come out to start isolating, isolating the deputy president to resign and then not talking about the president because we know as us as Jubilee is that we elected the presidency. Therefore, for our brother Junet to ask the deputy president to uh, resign and uh, to even claim that he has lost it, I think it is uh, not acceptable and us in the majority party of Jubilee, we will not allow our brothers in the minority to dictate to us what needs to be done in the majority side. We have uh, able leadership and we will continue to listen and uh, receive guidance from the president and from the deputy president. If our brother has any advice to make, he should make that advice, he should uh, uh, take that advice to where it belongs, to the uh, retired prime minister and his running mate who was then our brother from, uh, from Waipa, uh, Kalonzo Musyoka. But he should desist from advising the majority side on what to do. We are aware that there is... Uh, 
there is a handshake and the spirit of uh, BBI, but that does not give him an opportunity to guide us on what to do in the uh, majority side. Uh, Honorable Jonet talked of BBI having left, uh, moving from Kisi to now Kakamega on 18th, but I want to tell him that our excellence, the president has already appointed uh, a committee, a select committee, whose mandate has now been extended up to June 30th to bring a report. We would want, if they are law-abiding party, they should allow the committee to guide us on the future uh, BBI meetings, as opposed to uh, political parties uh, coming out with uh, programs that are not in line with that, what the committee, uh, the program that the committee has put in place. Because uh, in other words, what they are also triggering is that the ODM line, like the way we see, will have their own programs and that the Jubilee uh, team will also be forced to come up with uh, our, our programs and that will generally be uh, politicking and will therefore go out of the wishes of the president where the president had said that there will be no politics until when the time for general elections comes. Therefore, we just want to request on behalf of the other leadership that our brothers in the minority should know up to where they reach and not to try and crop on the grounds that does not really uh, belong to them because in the Jubilee site, which is majority site in the National Assembly, we have very able leadership that would guide us when and when it is proper for that kind of guidance. Therefore, I just want to correct and request our brother that uh, given that now we have a committee of a BBI in place, they should allow this committee to plan their programs. And because all of us are in support of uh, BBI, we will wait until when their program is out and we shall all attend the meetings that will be officially arranged and planned for by the BBI Select Committee. I thank you. Thank you. I just want to add on uh, what the Chief Whip has said, uh, that we are responding to the characters who are here a few days ago calling for the resignation of the Deputy President. I want Kenyans to ignore sentiments coming from them these are people who are confused. They belong to their party called ODM and the various uh, opposition parties. They don't know they are all, what their role is. They are supposed to put the government on toes. But here, they are calling for the resignation of the deputy president, who was jointly elected mm. by His Excellency Uhuru Kenyatta. But I, I am not surprised because what they said here is a confirmation of what we have been saying very many times, that the handshake was all about to divide Jubilee, to bring confusion in, in, in government. It was all about to isolate one William Ruto. And I want to assure them that as the people who are members of Jubilee Party, as people who are behind the manifesto and the vision of Jubilee Party that is anchored in our, in our party's constitution. And I want to remind them that uh, the roadmap to develop this country by the Jubilee government was spelled out and is going to cover, to cover 20 years. 10 for Uhuru Kenyatta and 10 for William Samoei Ruto. So as they continue to be confused, they don't know, I want to remind them that they, they are not the spokespersons of His Excellency Uhuru Kenyatta. Mm. They are not the spokesperson of Jubilee Party. Jubilee Party, we have a machinery, mm. apart from the few confusion that these people have brought, even up to now, with the level of education of United Muhammad, with the level of, of education of Muse Maina Kamanda, they don't know whether they are in the opposition or they are in the ruling party. Mm. How can you purport to speak on behalf of a party that we are not a member of? And I want to ask them to go to the nearest hospital to have their heads checked. Because sincerely, you cannot be calling for the resignation of the deputy president 
Yet you know that the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya is not an equivalent of the Vice President of the yeah, yesterday's yeah, Constitution. Yeah. This is, uh, is the, they are conjoined twins. Mm -hmm. If they don't want the Deputy President, let them wait until 2022 when Kenyans will go to the elections again to elect whoever will be President of this, of, of, of this country. Mm -hmm. And I will want to tell my inner commander that we are tired of him and as a party, we are paying for our sins. We nominated a person who took over the position for, that was reserved for women. Mm. Because what, is Maina, what does Maina Gamanda represent? He doesn't represent youth. Mm. He doesn't represent workers. Mm. He doesn't represent people living with disability, unless if he has a disability that is hidden somewhere, <laughs> that maybe he will tell us. Mm. So we are paying the sins that we did ourselves mm. uh, when we were nominating people to various positions. Mm. So I want Kenyans to ignore him mm. and, uh, you know, don't give him uh, much hearing. Mm. This is a fellow who defected two years ago to ODM. Mm. And it's clearly now that going forward is going to be the poor people mm. versus the rich people. Mm. Battle lines mm. has been drawn. Mm. Everybody should go where he belongs. Mm. As we are going to ensure that uh, going forward into the future, mm. you can rise from being a village elder, you can rise from being a pauper in the village mm. to be president of the Republic of Kenya. The presidency is not a reserve of the royal families. The fact that your father was the first prime minister of the Republic of Kenya, the fact that your father was the vice president during the colonial times does it make you a better person to understand the problem that bedevils this country going forward uh, and going forward we are going to remain united and I want to tell them that William Samoei Ruto is going nowhere. William Samoei Ruto is not going to resign, is going to continue discharging his duties as enshrined in the constitution of the Republic of Kenya. Thank you. No, 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 no. Na mimi nikependa kumuomba rais wetu uhuru ya kuwa kumbuke waluya walifanya nini kuhusu, kuhusu kura yake. Tulumpatia kura mingi, tukampatia wabunge nane, wakana nafanya mabadiliko kwa serikali yake amesao muluya. Kwanza kabisa, hii handshake hata mimi ningependa kuambia waluya. Handshake na umisa waluya, handshake ime marginalize waluya, wakati lukua na handshake, kijana wetu moja kapatasa kazi, mtu kutoka lua nyanza kaingia wakati huu amefanya mabadiliko hatujaona muluja akiwekwa na rais wetu e uhuru hatujaona tena kwa hiyo mabadiliko kama muluja amepitia upande wa NASA upande wa ODM kuingia kwa serikali kwa hivyo wakati umefika sasa waluja kuamuka kuona ya kuwa kama ni upande wa NASA upande wa ODM tuko marginalized upande wa uhuru tuko marginalized wakati huu kijana wetu Musali ya mudabadi, hametuita mumias, tuende huko, tuanza kusungumuza luka moja kama waluya, kwa mana tusipo, amuka, haraka, tuwe kwa serikari, ama tengenea serikari, tuendele kuhumia kama waluya. Santeni. Say this that uh, this country has a manifesto under the ruling party. And my plea to His Excellency that if he allows BBI to go the route it is going, then automatically we are going to lose track on what we intended to do for these Kenyans. Because allowing Raila and his group to take over BBI, I think that is not going to add value to the Kenyans. And I want to say this, that uh, without any fear of contradiction, we have a constitution in this country, and what Junet and the commander said here about the leadership of this country, I want to say in the strongest term possible that that is misplaced. This is the deputy president of this country, and as it were, he was elected together with His Excellency Uhuru Kenyatta, and they are going to steer this country to the next election of 2022, and let them be prepared that 
William Samoe Ruto takes over from Uhuru in, in 2022 to the next 10 years. So if they are not prepared for that, let them know that that is what is going to happen. Finally, I also want to urge the president that as a Luya nation, we played a very major role for him to be the president. He has sidelined us. Even in his reshuffle, there is no lawyer who has had any stake in it. And even on the other side of ODM, the handshake is there because lawyers are the one who voted for Raila, in fact, in large numbers. When you compare the numbers of lawyers to those of Luos, in fact, Luo numbers are very meager. So what propels Raila to be where it is, it is the lawyer vote. And therefore, the lawyers must wake up this time round. That even this meeting they are calling for in uh, Kakamega on 18, let them know that Raila is just using them. And that he just wants to renovate himself, to get back and see that he gets something going forward. So I want to urge the lawyers that are purporting to be with Raila that that is not going to happen, and we are here to say it in black and white, that the time for us to be used by Raila is over. And now we have got to vote for the new beginning for the Luya nation. Thank you. John Waluke, mbunge wa Serisia, na nataka kuongea kwa ufupi sana kuhusu mambo ya ya mkoa wa Makaribi, vile siasa iko na vile mheshimiwa Junet aliongea jana. Nataka kumkatasa Junet, nataka kuambia watu ya ODM wa wachane na mambo ya chama ya Jubili because walipigana wakitaka kuform serikali yao au kupigana kuform serikali ya jubili. sisi tulipigana kuform serikali ya jubili ya uhuru kinyata na william ruto na ni chambo lina ambalo linasangasa wa kenya kwa kwamba e, junet muti ya upinzani anakuja kwetu kusema ya kwamba william ruto a resign yeti yale kuwa huko wakipigana wakitaka kuform serikali na raila Inji hii meumia sana kwa muda mrefu. Mkikumbuka 2207. Eh, Paata ya kura, inji hili umia kwa jiri ya mweshimua prime minister. Kujaribu kupikanisha inji, kujaribu kufanya mali ya wakenya kuchomeka, kujaribu na hata wakenya wengi waliwawa. Kwa vile ya liona ameshindwa katika eh, hiyo uchakuzi na akaleta vita. Na anakuwa awe eh, relevant paata ya kura kila wakati. Anatafuta njia kis, eh, ya kumleta kwa mba wa Kenya wa mjue akiwa ame, ameshindwa kwa, kwa mambo ya uchakuzi. Alishindwa. 2017 alishindwa. Na kila mara akishindwa kwa kura uwa natafuta njia ya kuchiweke kwa ngufu na yula ambaya ameshinda ili e, wa share serekari. Kama hii, hakuna eh, kitu jote ya kusema ya kwamba atiyo handshake inasaidia e, e, wa Kenya because economy ya inji mekua mbaya sana kwa saisi, kwa jiri ya hiyo because economy iliaribika wakati mapikane ilikuwako, wakati mali ya watu ilichomwa. Sasa, Hakuna ichojota ambayo tunaweza kusema ati handshake. E, imecharibu kusaidia inji. Yes, kama kwa vita ime, imesimama. Lakini kwa upande ya, ya economy ya inji ni Raila alisababisha. Kwa hivyo, kwa wachane na mambo ya chama ya jubili. Na tunataka kuambia rais ya kwamba akumbuke vile ilikuwa. Na hata vile huyu huyu Raila 
alishukulika mambo ya 207 kuhakikisha ya kwamba baada ya kura Raila Amini Uhuru na na Ruto wamepelekwa heki haikuwa mtu mwingine ilikuwa ni ni Raila sasa 2017 again aingie na walishia serikali na eh, rais Kibaki kwa ajili ya hiyo sasa ni kama ameshia serikali saa hizi na mheshimiwa Uhuru Kinyata sisi kama wale tulipigania eh, serikali ya jubilee atukupigana bure tulipigana ili to form government na atukupigana ati ifomiwe na upi, upinzani sasa hizi watu wa wale tulipigania hii serikali tunakaa kama ni watu wa opposition na yet hatukupigana tuwe wa opposition tulipigana to form government and indeed we have formed the government on appointment ama changes zile amefanya siku ya leo wale walipigana kuangusha uhuru kinyata ndio wanafaitika na sisi wale tulipigana ku form serikali wenyewe hakuna chochote ambao tunafaitika hata ukiangalia list hata hiyo PPI e, committee si kuona muluya hata mmoja e, na sisi ni jamii kubwa jamii ya makaribi hata wakihesabu vizuri kama sensa zingekuwa kisawasawa we are number 1 in Kenya na appointments kikuja hakuna mahali ambao mwe, watu wa mkoa makaribi wako sasa hizi naenda Nyanza na tutasikia vizuri tutasikia raa e, tunaambia rais ya kwamba akumbuke mambo ya 1010 10, vile yeye alisema miaka kumi yeye miaka kumi e, ruto lazima ikuwe vile atukumwambia rais aongee hiyo na alitamuka kutoka kwa mdomo wake kwamba 10 10 na itakuwa 10 10 na naambia wakenya wote mahali wako kuanzia lotu paka migori kuanzia migori paka mandera kuanzia mandera paka busia ya kwamba waone kile kitu ambao kinaendelea na wasimame imara e, wakati wa kura ikifika kumsupport e, William Ruto vile rais uhuru alisema 10 10 na itakuwa hivyo asandeni I, I think my day as um, one of the members of Jubilee is that uh, the report is just coming in. Uh, we are yet to know uh, what necessitated the changes and maybe if they come then we will also be able to inform. But uh, the president has, as per the constitution, has the authority to change the cabinet as and whenever um, uh, he wants. Therefore, I'm sure uh, he may, uh, of course, uh, by his wisdom, he may have come up with those he thinks will help him run the government. Why Kyunjuru was uh, not included in the current uh, cabinet, we, uh, we can't mention, we can't comment at this point because we don't know. When we get to understand what may have necessitated, because you know there are a lot of things that are happening in the, in the ministries, we will then comment with the information when we get to that level. As for now, we want to believe that the president, using his wisdom, wisdom uh, to change the, 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 the cabinet.